Greetings guys, it is Stokecraft, and welcome back to another video on the channel. And today, as the title clearly indicates, we're going to be opening 36 of these Holiday Ops loot boxes of 2019. I'm really interested to see what these boxes will give us this year. So first of all, let me state what I am interested in during this loot box opening. I'm not going to be interested in the premium tanks pretty much, because the premium tanks that you can get in these loot boxes... The chance of them is really slim, as you all know. I'm just going to be aiming for the gold in the premium time, which is just nice to speed up my progress during this holiday season. If we get a tank, that's a nice bonus, you know, or any other thing, because there's a lot of things you can get in these boxes, as far as I know. I only invested in 25 of these loot boxes, and <laughs> believe it or not, 11 of them were gifted to me by... Probably my greatest viewer of all time, Bob underscore 15. He did it again, just like last year. But this time he upped his gift by the 8 boxes, which is just absolutely crazy. He spent 20 euros on me, which I still find absolutely preposterous. But we're going to take his boxes into account as well. So, other than me being inter interested in the gold and the premium time, I still want to see if we make a profit, you know, which is quite important to see. Because Wargaming state on their website that you actually run a profit... Uh, every single time over your whole opening which should be the case we'll see what happens anyway because let's be honest this is gambling and other than that i still want to see how these boxes compare to the ones of last year because last year i opened i believe 28 of them and still then i'm yeah made a profit but i still want to see if these boxes are any different or um, if there's any difference between the two so i have to say let's not waste any more time and let's get right into this Okay, everyone, let's not waste any more time. Let's get right into these loot boxes. We've got 36 of them to open. So let's see what these boxes will get me this time. Let's go. Open box. I think I'm just going to open them one at a time, you know? So this is the animation of this year. Looks very good, to be honest. Looks crazy good. Are you kidding me? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, this is this is not happening. This just can't be real. Like, the first box and you get a tier five tank. No fucking way, dude. <laughs> no, this is this is not happening. This can't be happening already, guys. Oh yeah, we got we got some in the decorations, of course, decorations, just like last year. In the first box, we get a tier five. Okay, like, never mind. <laughs> let's just let's just continue, man. That's that's absolutely crazy. I did not expect that one bit. I just want to get the premium time, to be honest. That's that's all I'm really aiming for. Now, nah, 500 gold, see? There you go. That's like a standard box, I guess. That would be the, the equivalent to one premium day and 250 gold. So, nice. There we go. 100,000 credits. There you go. Like, I know it's kind of a waste of money, you know? Spending money, getting credits. But in these loot boxes, it's kind of nice. Let's be honest. 100k is not bad, you know? It's, it's not bad. At all. Not bad at all. 500 gold again. Not too bad. I think... I'm not sure if you can get 250 as the lowest again this year. As the amount of gold. OMG. <laughs> Half a million. Nice, 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 nice. There we go. That looks good. Half a million is very, very nice. I'm, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna... Like, in Dutch we say, make any words dirty about that, but... That's probably not even English. Yes, first premium day. There we go. That's nice. 30 left. 30 left. I think you can get like skins from these boxes as well, right? 500 again. Okay. Just gold. Just gold. Nice. Yeah, what can I say? That's what I want. Again, 100k. Damn. Like, we got like, what's it now? 700k credits already? That's absolutely crazy, man. That's crazy. How did quickly that went? That's absolutely... Oh my god, are you kidding me? <laughs> Damn, that's a lot of credits. Holy shit. Okay, let's just continue, man. Damn. So... Another premium day, very nice. Like, 
So if we open one more, then we've opened like 25, right? So I guess that means that we kind of opened Bob's boxes or Bob's boxes are in the end. I don't even know. It doesn't really matter anyway. So we got, I think, three premium days, which is nice, of course. It's better than nothing. Yeah, okay, we got the crew member. That is awesome. That is nice. I actually, I actually kind of hoped to get this one. I didn't expect to get it, but I did get it, which is very nice. Like, I think during this event, you can get, like, female crew members in the holiday ops when you, like, uh, decorate your tree and anything else. Damn, we got we actually got this commander. So this is really nice. You can like put this on the, on the M4 we just got as like a reminder of that we got that as a Christmas present, I guess. That is nice. So I hope I hope he gets put into our barracks now. Yeah, he should. So we already opened 11. So I guess we now jump into like the part I paid. Nice, we got the crew member. Damn. That's nice. 500 gold. I guess that's probably the lowest you can get it seems like it i don't know at least it seems like that's the lowest you can get not a premium day very nice there you go that's just very nice so it's like four premium days already i'm really happy oh 750 not bad damn not bad at all no that is nice Yes, seven days of premium. Oh, ho, ho, and we actually got a skin. Damn. I think, actually, to be honest, this gorilla skin is my favorite one. It just looks so good. It just looks so good. Just look at that. Damn. It just looks so good. Just look, just look at that. How is that for a thumbnail? <laughs> I'm just saying. Okay, so I quickly turn up the music a little bit just to see what it sounds like. I just want to experience this, you know. Nice 100k credits. Damn. Nice one. We got like a crap load of credits already. This is absolutely ridiculous, man. <laughs> absolutely ridiculous. Not a premium day. That is nice. That's what I want. Premium days. And the skin was very nice as well. Did not expect the skin at all. That was very nice. Very nice indeed. Another 100k. Damn. Damn. Like, this way we're gonna be able to afford, like, a tier 9 tank or something. Perhaps even a tier 10. But I do still need to grind them. Otherwise, I don't get anything from it. Nice, another one. Another premium day. Nice. I turn on the music. It's really nice, actually. The music. Ha! Oh, ha, 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 500k. Look at that. Damn. That is nice, though. Yeah, I'm, I'm really happy about these credits, actually. Because credits is probably the hardest thing to get. Like, I know you can just wave your credit card and get them anyway. Ooh, three days. Yes. Very nice. Nice, nice, nice. Let's just continue, man. I want to get more premium days. And gold at the same time. But you pretty much always get gold, right? Nice. So we got 14 left. So we opened quite a few already, actually. We already passed the half of it. Oh, we got another skin. Ooh, hoo, 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 the T-57 one. Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This looks this looks very nice. I'm not gonna lie. I think I prefer the gorilla skin over this one, though. But still, it looks very nice. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. Just look at that. It just looks crazy. Crazy good. Open next. That just looks crazy good, man. What, what, like, what can you say about it? I think it's awesome that they put these in these boxes. Another 100k, very nice. Damn, we're actually gonna make a lot of credits here. Like, a lot of credits. Nice. Damn, we're actually gonna get... I think we got enough already, like, premium days. Like, somewhere around 14 days. 100k, damn. Again, like... I'm not sure, but I don't quite remember what the variety was of the boxes last year. I have no clue, actually, what the variety was. But it seems like the variety went down. But you can get, like, uh, skins this time, which is nice. And the crew member, of course. Which is really nice. It's crazy, man. I really like the animation, though. Yes, three days of premium. Oh, and we get the AE7 skin as well. Damn. 
Oh, yeah. Oh, it returns the machine gun port on top. Yes. Yes, it does. Oh, yeah, that's cool. Yeah, that's really cool. That's awesome, man. I think this is my second favorite one. But I still think the Gorilla one is my favorite. We, so we got three days of premium. 250 gold and the skin. Holy shit. Oh, yeah, and the skin, of course, gives you camo advantage. Damn. That is awesome. Damn. I'm, I'm, like, really impressed with these skins so far. They just look absolutely awesome. I just have to say, man. They just look absolutely awesome. How many more premium days will we get? Another one. Nice, nice, nice. So we got six left in total. So we actually op already opened 30. Holy shit. We opened 30. Holy shit. And we get more credits. Just crazy. Absolutely crazy. Another credits. Damn. So we only got four left. So this is, this is basically the end of it all. Basically the end of it all. 500 gold. Nice. So the last three will be opening, everyone. I'm not gonna spend any more money on this, of course. I think it's just... Other than just showing it, it's just a waste. Seriously, do we get that one as well? Oh, yes. I also really, really like this skin, I have to say, though. I really do like this skin as well. It looks awesome. Damn. Unique style for the Betjet 25T. Damn. Oh, yes, that looks awesome. So we got a premium day, 250 gold, and a skin. So, last two boxes we will be opening in this Holiday Ops event. At least large boxes. Probably a small few ones. Okay, so the very last box we will be opening here is gonna be this one. So let's see what we get. We got 500 gold in the last one, which is nice. Let's see. Very nice, everyone. And we get 250 gold. And another premium day, which is crazy. Acknowledged. So... Let's go back here. 23 days. That's plenty for my holiday season. So that's absolutely great. Let me just quickly state. We did not get any tier 8 premium. And look at that. We still got a tier 5 tank. Which I'm really happy about. I think last year I got a lot more tanks. But now oh well. What can you do about it right? I think it's time to see what the actual gain in, uh, in credits and gold was. And so forth. So let's take a look at that. To show you the results of these loot boxes, I've made a few visuals for you. First up, we're going to be looking at the results of the loot boxes of 2019, the ones I just opened. And after that, we'll be comparing the loot boxes of this year and last year. First up, the results of this year. On the left side of this visual, you can see an overview of all the items that were obtained, as well as the gold value of each individual obtained items. Next to that, a factor column is indicated, which basically indicates the amount of times I got a certain item. And the very last column indicates the amount of gold that was obtained with each specific item. But I have to highlight something. If you look at the Simon Claus crew member that we got. With the star icon I'm basically trying to say that I assumed that Simon Claus is a 100% crew member as you can regularly buy in the World of Tanks client. Which basically means that he costs 200 gold. Be aware that this is an assumed value and that the real Simon Claus is probably worth way more than 200 gold. As it already has two fully trained skills. In addition to that, I was not able to find the exact gold value of the special skins that I obtained in these loot boxes. So I basically assumed that these were worth the same as any tier 10 uh, tank skin, basically. All these gold values added up to a total of 26,050 gold. According to the World of Tanks Premium Shop, that equals 86 euros and 63 cents. As I spent 40 euros on these Holiday Ops boxes, I basically make a profit of 47 euros and 41 cents. If the 11 boxes that I also opened were not gifted to me, I needed to pay a total amount of almost 60 euros, which means that my profit goes down to around 27.42 euros. Either way, we made a profit. And now next up, we're going to compare the boxes that I opened this year and the boxes that I opened last year. In this next visual, you will be able to see the overview of the items that I obtained in this year and the items that I obtained last year. Do note that this year I opened 36 boxes of which I recorded the results and last year I opened only 25 boxes of which I recorded the results. I do quickly want to add that last year I forgot to include two inscriptions that I got. I assume that each of these inscriptions is worth 50 gold. The thing that should really spark your interest in this overview is that even though I opened less boxes last year, I managed to get a higher gold value. 
This is probably due to the tier 8 tank that I managed to get last year. And I didn't get just one tier 8 tank, I also got two tier 4 tanks. Consequently, this should mean that I made more profit last year than I did this year. Which is exactly the case as can be seen in this overview. This year, over 36 boxes, I made a profit of 47 euros and 41 cents. And last year, over 25 boxes, I've made a profit of 53 euros and 84 cents. This weird outcome sparked my interest to see what the results would be if I didn't include any of the tanks I got. So this is what you will see in this next overview. Now a big difference becomes clear very quickly. Apart from tanks, this year I obtained a lot more items than last year. Which should basically indicate that this year I actually made a lot more profit if you don't include the tanks. And this is exactly the case if you take a look at this next overview. From this I can basically conclude that last year I managed to get a lot of tanks, which basically regulated my profit. But this year I didn't get many tanks at all. But my profit this year was regulated by a lot of different items that I obtained. Alright everyone, to conclude this loot box opening, I just quickly want to say that this loot box opening, we didn't get that many tanks to be honest. We basically got our money's worth in items that we obtained like skins or crew members, which I think is awesome as well. But I'm not gonna lie, I find it a bit disappointing that we didn't get any premium tanks. Not because I want them specifically, but pretty much because I think that would have made the video a lot more awesome than it already was. Lastly, I want to give a quick shout out to Bob underscore 15. Thank you very much for sending your boxes my way. I really enjoyed opening them. And uh, thank you for giving me that chance again this year. And I really enjoyed it. Alright, before I let you guys go, I just wanted to wish each and every one of you a merry merry Christmas and a very happy new year. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like as I did put a lot of time into making this video as usual. And subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see each and every one of you in the next video. Bye guys.